I think with Marcus, Marcus don't look like Michael. Marcus don't play like Michael. There's nothing about Marcus that says Michael. And I think, I think Marcus is, is, is kind of re rebelling because of that. I think, I think, I think when, when he sees his dad, he doesn't see himself. He doesn't see that greatness in himself. And I think he kind of holds that against him. And I think this is to, to piss his dad off more than anything. Mm. Yo, that's crazy. I never thought of that. I never I thought of that. So, so, so you think even at 30 something years old, being a child of, of, of a uber famous, uber rich celebrity icon, this man can still be rebelling just based off his bloodline. I look at the small situation with me in court and you gotta understand like when kids are looking at me and they see people loving you, they're looking at it like, fuck that. I'm supposed to be loving him. He's supposed to be loving me. They're looking at that. And now, Michael, can you imagine being Michael J Jordan's son? Everybody in the world probably wants to be Michael Jordan's son who, who plays basketball. Like, he's probably going through shit that we can't even dream of. And, you know, it, it, it's obvious. This is a rebel move. This is a move to piss Michael off, you know, and he, you know, and, 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 and it's working. It's working. You know, he's pissing motherfuckers off. You know, for Mike to say, hell no, that shows you. Mike don't say nothing. That Never. shows you, that shows you alone that Mike is pissed the fuck off. And you nah, know, I, you know, I mean, listen, everybody's using each other. He's using her to piss off motherfuckers. She's using him to piss off motherfuckers. That ain't gonna last. When when you're with somebody for outside. For other than I love, for other than love one another, it never lasts. No, Give it a it couple more years. Give it a couple more years. That shit's gonna be over. I don't even see it lasting a couple more years. And, and here's the deal, right? Homegirl, homegirl, she was with Future. She she didn't been with all kind of That's people. That's all right. You know what? It's all. Listen, women are gonna be with guys. That's just how it is. So when you're with famous like Lori Harvey, look at Lori Harvey. You know, yeah, yeah. you know, I mean, look, you know, the famous, more famous you are, the more famous men you get, and then it gets polarized. It gets, like, you know, magnified. But at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? Women are out here getting their rocks off, man. And you know what I'm saying? Shit, like men are. I mean, we live in a hyper-sexualized society right now, especially in a society of the internet where being with somebody gets you clout and comments and clicks. So, you know, you know I mean, hey, listen, God bless everybody. I just... Hope everybody's strapping up, man, because HIV and AIDS is still out here, you know? Real thing, it's a real thing. What's up, guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love. Make every move a power move, and I'll catch you all on the next video.